What is up guys, Sky here again, and in this video I'm going to show you a new feature D2L has just rolled out that allows you to tag other students in your class in a discussion post in that course shell. So this is kind of like the tagging feature on Facebook or Twitter where you basically just type in the at symbol and then start typing the name of somebody else in that course and it will allow you to click them from a list and it will then tag them. And if they have the notification setting enabled, then they will get an email when you have tagged them. So this is really helpful for when you're having a long discussion post kind of conversation with one or more people. And this is also something that faculty can use when they respond to your posts in a discussion form as well. So first, let's look at how to enable that notification setting. When you go up here to your profile and click on it and go to notifications, it'll bring up a lot of different options all kind of in a list like this. You'll want to find the ones that say discussions and of those the first one should say mentioned in a discussion post or thread. That's what this feature is called. It's not really called tagging, it's called a mention but mention tagging it's the same thing. And so you're going to want to make sure that you enable that setting over here which is for email notifications for mentions. And so once that's enabled and the little checkbox is checked we'll click save. And then from there, we can start tagging, or at least we can start getting notifications when someone else tags us. So we'll go up to a course shell, our Teaching Online Effectively Retreat, and I'll go to More and down to Discussions. And then I will go to our Day 1 Peanut Butter and Jelly exercise and start a new thread. And I'll just go ahead and call it Test. And so to mention slash tag somebody, you just type the at symbol and then start typing their name. And as you can see, I come up right away. I'm the only sky in the class. But if there were multiple skies, they'd all come up. And so I'll click on that, and then I'll just put test message here. And I will click post. And now that that's posted, I should get an email notification here shortly. And there's my email notification. I don't know if you guys could hear that, but it just popped up in my inbox. On top of that, if I go up here to refresh, you'll see under the notifications icon here, I now have a new one. The little orange dot signifies that. I click on that, you can see that I mentioned me in a thread. And so that's pretty much all there is to know about mentioning slash tagging somebody. Again, People will need to have that notification setting turned on, so that's why I showed you how to turn yours on. Hopefully, students can start turning those on. And I will also mention that new students from here on out will have that notification setting on by default. So if you tag somebody, hopefully they will get an email, and it'll be a really helpful way for them to know that you've responded and they can respond back. As always, if you have any questions or any concerns, you can always email us at onlinehelp at okcu.edu.